Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Ray Ray Beats, indie hip hop producer extraordinaire, representative of BeatsBros.com. Today I'm vlogging about a music video that was shoved in my face by WorldStarHipHop.com. It was on the main page, and I looked on YouTube. It's on YouTube now as well. It's called Peace Pipe by Emerson Wendy. I watched the whole music video uh, multiple times, and this is just a commentary now on my take from the music video from my point of view as a hip hop producer. The song itself, the lyrics, and the imagery in the music video definitely accommodate anybody who's a big fan of smoking weed uh, and getting high. The artist said that uh, like, if you smoke enough weed, you'll see Jesus. I'm not really sure that's true. It might be Satan posing as Jesus. I don't think you see Jesus when you smoke a lot of weed though. Some of the cool imagery that's in the music video, his costume throughout the whole thing is like an Indian headdress with no shirt on. So he just looks like an Indian chief, but he's wearing Wayfair sunglasses with like black lenses. And that shit's pretty dope. I guess it's cool imagery you know because if you smoke a lot you're considered a chief or whatever uh, during the music video they get some powwows going on dancing around a drum circle and stuff like that and they smoke a lot of weed they blow a lot of weed towards the camera and shit smoke coming out of fucking people's mouths they use a lot of cool filters too and like cool different colors it's definitely very trippy and psychedelic the beat is really simple i enjoyed the beat it has those 808 sub bass kicks that are like really dope and everybody loves right now i enjoy those too so there's a lot of deep sub bass a really cool Cool synth line some snare rolls every now and then the Beatles solo out on just like some Native American sounding whistle loop or some shit like that this is definitely geared towards hardcore pot smokers uh, it's a cool song I enjoyed it definitely not going back and watching it anymore this definitely doesn't satisfy me though as a hip-hop listener uh, just the banality of repetitive drug use over and over again everything I see blowing up or getting popular is about drugs and that bores me quite frankly I'm really bored of it I'm over it I'm done with seeing rappers talk about drugs and getting high and selling drugs and thugging and stuff like that fucking I want somebody to make a rap song about the matrix or a Raymond Chandler novel so reach out to me if you're making rap songs about robots taking over the world I'm definitely interested in that I want something that's gonna make me think you know what I'm saying second renaissance parts one and two but yeah I looked a little bit into this artist I googled him and he's apparently like played shows with really big rappers like T.I. and stuff like that and Lil Wayne so cool for him good shit I like the music video it's very professional I, I enjoyed it for what it was I'm just bored of the drugs in mainstream hip-hop I want to hear like literary and film references anyway everybody have a great day this is beats vlog number five I'm just talking about a music video that I saw and these are my thoughts on it from the perspective of an independent hip-hop producer you're entitled to your opinion as well so leave it in a comment don't forget to subscribe to my channel for beat making tutorials beat making videos live performances free sample packs yada 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 so much more all right everybody have a great day don't hate me unless you're gonna leave a comment about how much you hate me then you can hate me all right i love you guys all i hope everybody has a great day i don't mean to be a hater it's just in my blood